Today is take two in Spark Wars 2024. All right, guys, we got our first spark order of the day for the challenge. It's got to be picked up at 745. And it is $36.68. It's to go 8.2 miles. It's for three curbside drop-offs. And we're going to be able to start our trip here in just a second or two. All right, guys, good morning. Today is Saturday, May 4th. It is about quarter to eight right now um we are about to pick up our first order of the day it is a 39 dollar 26 cents uh three drop 11.7 miles uh we are also live currently right now with dashing dink doing our live stream um it's gonna be pretty awesome today i think he just got his first order of the day as well he got a 36 dollar order i was kind of surprised that i actually managed to beat him on the first drop uh he got his order first but yeah we're headed to pick it up now i'm gonna pull into the curbside lot and we'll see you guys after we're done Alright everyone, we're sitting back in the Walmart uh, curbside lot. After those first three curbside drop-offs we did, and we did not get a second um, round robin, but Drew just picked up a $43 shopping order. It is for 80 plus items, so it should take him a while, so I'm hoping I can get a round robin while he's doing this and at least stay in the running, but just wanted to keep you guys updated. All right, guys, we went ahead and got a express shopping order. We got a $43.12, 2.5 mile shopping order, 43 unique items, 84 total items. So this order is pretty big. Um, we both sat for the round robin. Dink and I both didn't get one. Uh, Dink doesn't have an order right now. So definitely put me farther in the lead. Um, we're going to bring you guys in for the car cam, and we'll see you guys after I'm done shopping. All right, everybody, we sat here for a long time, but we finally got a uh, round robin $39.06 it's for three curbside drop-offs it, it is going 12.7 miles but all the orders are tiny tiny orders 25 19 and 13 I believe so we are at least going to stay in the running with Drew so we got to pick it up at 945 so we got about 10 minutes
All right, guys. Um, I just received another curbside offer, but it was like twelve dollars and ninety six cents. It was for two drop offs going six point three miles or something. Both of the orders were like in the thirties for quantity, but one of them is going clear to the east side of Lake Bemidji, which is like the farthest point you can get from Walmart, even if it is six point three miles and um there was no tip on it so i did not accept that offer <laughs> i maybe should have because i probably you know cut my own throat by not taking that order but hopefully something else will come up and now i just received a curbside 35 dollars 21 it's for three drop-offs to be picked up at 12 45 it's going 9.4 miles A63. Yeah. Alright guys, well we lost Dink there for a little bit um, when he was delivering an order and the live stream ended. Wasn't sure if he was gonna come back. We're back on live now with him. He's delivering like the second and the third order of his curbside. So I'm not gonna count this for our challenge, but I will count it at the end of the day when I finish um, at, for a total. I picked up a McDonald's earned by time. I think it was going 4.3 miles or something like that. Uh, I had to wait for a little bit. It's a decent amount of stuff, so I could see a decent tip being on this, but we'll see, not too worried about it. Um, and then we'll head back to Walmart and see what else we can get. Catch you guys after I'm done. Um, Rebecca, thank you much. Enjoy your breakfast. All right, guys, our next order is an express shopping order. We got $36.15 to go 4.7 miles for 29 unique items, 36 total items. Um, I would bring you guys in for the car cam again. However, my battery after that last one for the GoPro hasn't really been charging at all. So I'm at like 38% on the GoPro. So we're going to go ahead and leave you guys in here for this one. But I'll see you guys after I'm done shopping. Guys, we had to restart the live again. Um, we're doing it on my channel now just because it looks like his was glitching out a little bit. I don't know if it's his channel or what it was, but we're back. Again, he's in right now doing a $21.50 shop, I believe, and I'm gonna go ahead and do a $24.09 shop for 2.7 miles. I think his was 2.8 miles. His is for 20 items, mine's for 27 items. I think he said his was all grocery though, and I know I've seen at least one item that's not all grocery, so mine might take a little bit longer, but obviously my pain better. Um, yeah, we'll see you guys after I'm done.
There was once a day that I would pray for you I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too Sneaking looks up and down from across the room and Damn, what a hell of a view I feel good, you look great I like you, I can't wait A first time, a first day You're so fine, I'm so late You sip wine, I drink straight Don't waste time to my place I feel my heart erase So catch me if I fall All right, guys, we just got ourselves another Spark offer. It is $26.47, I believe. It's for one drop. It's going five miles. And it is quite a few units. It's like 73 units, but we'll throw it in two different totes. Nothing is bulky, nothing is heavy. And we'll get this out to the customer. All right, guys, after sitting for a while, I got a $21 um, flat 2.2-mile uh, express shop 10 unique items 14 total items gonna go ahead and bring you guys in with the gopro we'll see you guys afterwards
All right, guys, right after we went ahead and did that shopping order, I did see a first come, first serve. It's a three drop curbside for $34.74 to go 5.2 miles. Uh, we got a couple like medium ish orders, but not like super big orders. And then the last one I think is a smaller order, so won't be too bad. Uh, it does say there's a bulky item, but for all we know, that could be bubbler. I didn't actually really check anything. I am in the Walmart curbside lot just waiting for the order, and we'll see you guys after I got in my car. All right, guys, we just finished that one drop kind of out by Wilton um, and I got back and we were waiting and it was down to the to the wire I mean it was like literally 235 and I did get a curbside it was a good one it's forty one dollars and thirty six cents for three drops seven point five miles all the drops are very small however that is exactly pretty much what I needed to catch up or go ahead of Drew just a little bit He got one for $46 for like 11.7 miles. So he does have a few more miles. Um, the orders are about the same size, but. <laughs> so after we get done with these, I'm still gonna be about $45 down, but we're still plugging away and trying. So we'll get it. All right guys, made it back in time for the round robin drop. We got a $46.67 11.3 mile drop. First order is gonna be kind of heavy. It says it's only 32 items in a small order, but I checked the order and it has 16 of the sparkling waters. So it's gonna be kind of heavy and it's going to an apartment complex, but it's um, the one that's not too bad overall in order to drop this off, so it won't be that bad. Second order is a large order. I didn't check to see if it has a 35 pack of water, but it doesn't say 40 to 50 pound item. Um, so I'm gonna guess maybe it has one of those or something maybe like a dog boot or something. And then the last one is gonna be a small order, so that one won't be too bad. Um, the second and the third drop are both houses, so it won't be too bad. Uh, just waiting here for about five-ish minutes before we can go ahead and pick it up, and we'll see you guys afterwards. <laughs> Thank you. 
Uh, definitely the real Sigma. We are doing uh, gig work. In particular, a spark challenge. <laughs> that is not much of a challenge anymore. <laughs> All right, guys, um, I just dropped off that $17 one drop uh, spark order. And I didn't even get out of the driveway and we received a really good one, but it's still not gonna be enough to catch up to Drew. But I got a $53.98 two drop going five miles. Both of the orders are fairly big. One is 75 units and the other one is like 63. But at this point in time, I need it, I want it. So, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, make our way back to Walmart. It was uh, arrive ASAP, first come, first serve. So I just took it for the 54 bucks. All right guys, we're heading back to Walmart now. Right, guys we just got that um, two drop spark order dropped off uh, our second drop done and that was for $53.98 now immediately when I got back in the truck I got a $24.29 two drop for 5.2 miles uh, the one order is 10 items and the other one is one item so I went ahead and took that too this is this one here is the one that should put us over $300 for the day so let's go get it Hello kitty kitty. Hi kitty kitty. Hi kitty kitty. <laughs> kitty kitty.
right guys uh, I just dropped off uh, the first order of this three drop I picked up I think I forgot to make a recording for it uh, it's twenty nine dollars thirty one cents to go three my or five point five miles three drop offs uh, headed to the second one now we're about two minutes out we'll see you guys after I'm done Alright guys, our next order is an express shopping order for $32.82 going 2.6 miles. Uh, it's 20 items I believe total roughly. Uh, I'm not going to bring you guys in because I got 36% left on the GoPro, but um, I will see you guys after I'm done shopping. All right, guys, um, we waited until the round robin dropped, so I've got a 745 pickup. It's $30.07 for two drop-offs. Both of them are, are very small orders. Um, one's going to an apartment. The really small one is like seven items or nine items, but it is four 12-packs and one case of pop. So that one's gonna be a little heavy but we'll get it, we'll get it done. So, and it's going nine miles, so. We're just waiting for it to come out. All right guys, we just picked up a uh, $16 flat order from Walmart, it's a no-tip order, two drop-offs, going only two miles though. I'm trying to help Walmart now, as it seems like I'm probably one of the few drivers that are still left out, um, picking up their orders that are falling behind. We're already doing a real good job um, today, so I'm not too worried about it. Um, we'll see you guys after I'm done. All right guys, our next order is gonna be a $25.50 cents cent to drop eight miles. I think both of them are apartments. The first one is for sure. I don't remember what the second one looks like, but we'll see you guys after I'm done. All right guys, we just picked up a three drop, $36.76 to go 11.2 miles. Uh, not a bad order overall, should be pretty straightforward. Uh, I think one of them is an apartment, I can't remember. But headed to the first drop, we're eight minutes away. We'll see you guys after we're done. All right, guys. Well, our next order is a three drop, eighteen dollars seventy nine cents to go three point eight miles. Um, I'm not sure if this one really had a tip on it. Obviously, you guys will see it up on the screen. Um, 
but all three of these are going to apartment complexes which is not the greatest but you know at this point i'm just trying to help walmart catch up so i mean it's really not that big a deal to do this um for them there are some more like better orders that obviously you know would be better to take however you know i'm almost or this will put me over 500 on the day so i'm not too worried about it i think today was a really good day there are some you know better orders like i said that i'll come back and get some um there are some more uh i was gonna say uh spark drivers out now i don't know why they finally came back maybe because they realized there was a lot of orders sitting there but um we'll see if we can catch the walmart up uh with their orders all right see you guys afterwards all right guys our next order is a two drop 27 dollars 48 cents to go 4.6 miles headed to the drop off now we are three minutes away catch you guys afterwards All right, everybody, it is getting dark. <laughs> and it is currently 8.51. I stuck it out at Walmart until 8.35 and I did receive a round robin curbside order and it was not horrible. I believe it was for $26 and some change. It was to go six point two miles or something like that. And it was only for 24 items. But the area that it was going to, I think I know the place it was going to. And I decided no. <laughs> so I decided to call it a night. We ended up doing $349.68 because we had a $2 cash tip. Drew is still going. He's going until close because he's doing a three-day challenge on his own of working open to close for Walmart Spark um, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So, <clears throat> But I really want to thank you guys for hanging out. I want to thank you for checking this video out. Uh, maybe I can get some of Drew's footage and add it in here. I don't know. But anyway, guys, awesome day. I am tired, but we stuck it out. And I want to thank you guys for subscribing to the channel. We we got we gained seven subs doing this challenge, which was awesome. And I want to thank you guys for watching, liking, sharing, and commenting on the videos. I always have a blast um, corresponding with you guys via the comments. So thank you guys again. I appreciate it. And this is Dashing Dink saying, until the next dash. Have a great night, everyone.